What's up guys, it's your boy Jay back with another video for The Happening. First of all, thank you guys for watching our videos. We thank you for liking, commenting, as well as subscribing. Man, we appreciate your love. We love you guys like always. Me and boy Goody, we, we, we just work in. We always work in, get some content out, some knowledge more importantly, like usual. So watch for this video, it's gonna be very informative. If you like our content and if you wanna know more about styling as well as fashion, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. Keep liking our videos, keep commenting. We got a lot of stuff coming at you. Stay tuned. Bang! Today I want to talk about the first outfit, which I call the vintage outfit because I love wearing these vintage Levi's jackets. From the 70s, I believe, I got it at the vintage store. You can tell it's from the 70s or the 80s around that time because of the orange Levi's tag. So it's super vintage, it's over 40 years old. It got that nice distress in, it's very destroyed. I got it around this condition. I mean, I loved it because of the fade, honestly. It just looks broken in, you got a bit of that boxy fit. So I love that piece. I wear it all the time and for the spring and the summer you can wear it you know, during the day or at night. It's very versatile. Again, it's a staple. You should have these kind of pieces because it goes with around everything that you have. So I got this vintage jacket at a vintage store called Cue de Sac in Montreal on Saint Laurent. Very nice store. I love to get uh, a lot of the vintage jackets there. I got three vintage jackets uh, from that store. Go check them out. And then next up, I got this Metallica Fear of God tee, which I love wearing because of the fit, the design. It's the most comfortable tee I have. I mean, I love wearing it. It goes with everything, honestly. It's one of my staples as well. And I love wearing it with this vintage jacket because of the colors. You got that nice vintage blue, the white, and it just matches well with the vintage jacket. I also got this tee on Grailed. It was about 100 bucks. I mean, you can't really find this anymore on Grailed. I try to look for it. Uh, but very rare, I mean, not a lot of people have this, the fit is crazy, man, my favorite piece, like I said. And then I got my nudie jeans, and then I love wearing these, they're very minimal, they're sort of distressing, you know, they're, they're getting that nice fade as I wear them every single day, which a good denim should do. You should buy and invest in good denim so that they mold with how you wear it and, you know, depending on how you, like when you wear it as well, how you wash it, etc. These nudie jeans, I got it at where I work. We sell nudie jeans, I mean, we sell a lot. And uh, I just I just got them because I needed a classic black denim. You always need your staples, man. And I got my Garner Project boots. I love wearing these, nice tobacco suede. It just, it's a very simple, minimal addition to the outfit. It just complements the whole, overall of the outfit as well and i got the mix in colors as well don't forget the colors i got the blue the black as well as the tobacco and then i got these boots at boutique tati as well where i work um i just love these boots i just needed another chelsea boot because i always wear the black leather ones i just love them i love wearing them and uh, i just needed another one and it has that nice color i wear a lot of black anyway so it goes really blends well so not too flashy you should always have around three colors in one outfit if you have more it starts to become a bit too flashy but as long as you have your blacks your blues as well as you know a different color you're set for life my friend you're set for life the outfit's gonna be fresh you're gonna be fresh Let's go for the next outfit. For my second outfit, it's for more of a night out, you know what I'm saying? You wanna look fresh, nice and classy on a nice Saturday night. You wanna go for dinner with your partner or you wanna go clubbing. I mean, you wanna look fresh. So I suggest this clean wool outfit. I got the wool blazer, the merino wool turtleneck, as well as my wool pants and some leather shoes, flexible. Jeans, flexible. <laughs> So what I, why I'm going all wool is because wool is a very special but classic fiber. It keeps the warm when it's cold outside, but it also keeps you fresh when it's cool. You know what I'm saying? So it keeps that heat when you know when it's cold. So you you're, you stay warm, but when it's hot, 
it actually evaporates the heat very quickly. So I like to wear it at night because it's in the between, you know what I'm saying? In the spring and the summer, it's sort of chilly, but it's not, it's not hot. I, it's like chilly, but it's not hot either. So I like to wear this outfit just to look fresh, but also to make it very useful in what you wear. That's why I suggest to buy things that are, you know, made of quality, it's useful in your wardrobe, it looks good, it matches with everything that you have. It's very important that you think about what you buy because again, you are spending money on it. So spend it smart, you know what I'm saying? So I got this blazer from Rochas. It's a French, uh, I guess it's a French suiting brand. I got it at a vintage store for $15, you know what I'm saying? And it fit perfectly, you know what I'm saying? Like, it has that classic look. I got this Philippa K Merino turtleneck. I wear it all the time. You probably see me in the videos all the time. In the happening videos, I'm wearing it too. And uh, it's just super classic. You know, I like to wear my chains with it because it stands out as well. And then I got my Wheel Me uh, trousers, wool trousers. I love it because it's super oversized. It's like a weird fit, but you know, it's very traditional, like on the 50s, I would say. And it's such a nice color, nice camel color. I got it on sale at Simon's. Man, I get all my stuff for really cheap. And I got my Juan Les Ancel shoes. I love these, they're just classics, you know, nice and white. I like to beat them up just to make it look a bit more vintage. And you know what I'm saying? Like this fit is just your, it's not for every day, I would say, not when it's like 30 degrees. However, I like to wear it during the night or at work, you know, when it's a bit chilly. And, uh, yeah, keep it classy, man. So this is my third outfit. I like to keep it vintage because that's the recurring theme right now. I got this vintage leather jacket, as you know. I got it for like 100 bucks at uh, Cutest Sack. That's where I get all my vintage jackets, actually. I also got this tee from there, too. The Hard Rock Cafe from San Francisco for around $15. I mean, I love it because it's very similar to the fit as the Metallica one. Uh, it's a very loose fit very comfortable, the cotton is nice. I like wearing it, it's very minimal, you know, you can wear anything, honestly, like the color as well, the gray. I got my gray pants, I got it in Korea, I don't know what the brand is called, but it's a very dope crop pant, got a nice colorway, it has those little pleats in the middle, very classy, keeping it simple, keeping it minimal, as well as I got my TGs, Air Force One. Um, I love these, these are my straight up grails, I've been wanting it since, since it came out, and, what, 2014, I believe. And I've been rocking these every single day. Shout out to boy Jace for hooking me up with these. Um, they're, they're just aging so nicely. The leather is crazy. The colorway is amazing. I can wear it with, I wear a lot of black as you, as you know. So I like wearing black with these shoes because it stands out. So this is my three fits for spring. Thanks for watching guys. We really appreciate you watching our videos. Please subscribe, like, and comment our videos. We love your support. We love, just ask us any questions, man. Honestly, if you know, if you want to have any questions about styling or about how to rock certain things, let us know in the comments below. I'll definitely answer you guys with not a problem. Tell me what you guys think about these three outfits. What would you do different? How would you wear it? Comment below what you want to see next in our videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Peace.